Welcome. You Aquarians. Okay, let's see what's happening for the Aquarians in this week. This week is a fire week, you Aquarians. So be careful what is happening, what is transpiring, you Aquarians. Um, be very careful. There is a situation with the lovers. So um, be aware of this issue, what is going on. So let's see what is coming up for the Aquarians. This week is the second week. Week begins from the 10th until the 16th. It is the energy of the people in power. So some of you could be dealing with um, an Aries, Leo, or a Sagittarius. This could be a family member, okay? And you have to find inner balance to deal with this person, whoever this person is. Um, the Queen of Pentacles is also here. The latest five of years, like a year and older. Then we have the La Empress, where we are dealing, where we are dealing with um, um, uh, victory and success over an issue, and you're going to be moving away. Okay. So, okay, let's look at what is transpiring. I love, I love this deck. This is one of my favorite, favorite decks. And if you have been reading with me, some Eight of Cups, a lot of you are walking away from relationships or issues that has to do, but you're turning your back on something. Whatever it is, it could be turning your back on the lovers. Um, but you Aquarians are definitely turning away okay so we have three major arcana four major arcana five oh my god you aquarians oh my god so you aquarians are having some major issue okay um you aquarians are going to be overcoming a situation that you had to deal with with the, the a lady um this lady is an aries leo or a sagittarius whether this lady is you were dealing with this lady and uh, you are getting over this issue okay so let's um look and see what's coming up for the aquarians so with a lady this could be a mother i'm getting for you aquarians this is definitely a mother you're having issues some of you are aquarians are dealing with your mom and there is uh, um, issues of uh, money money or materialistic it could be you have been always giving your mom or your mom is saying that you owe her that sort of a thing but there is definitely issue um, with your mom that this is definitely coming up i'm seeing some of you could be in a relationship with a taurus virgo or a capricorn but this is more of a, a virgo some of you might be in relationship with a virgo or thinking about going um in a relationship with a virgo person 45 years and older it is yes go ahead um yeah so here is this lady um you Aquarians are thinking whether or not you should go ahead in a relationship with this person whether um, you're going to ask them the answer of marriage or um, that sort of a thing it is a yes go ahead it is fine um, wonderful energies because whoever this person is you both are going to be um, building together with this person so that is very beautiful very beautiful and the last time I've been also saying to myself, I need to do because I'm quick, 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 quick because I'm here. But now I'm, I'm taking more time to look at it. I'm seeing definitely there's a mother and a, a mother and a child issue that is going on about materialistic thing. Okay. I'm seeing some of you, if you have an aunt that is a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, um, you're going to go live with her or you're going to go connect with her and, um, you both oops it days the page of pentacles is coming in um there is a message the page of pentacles just flipped out so i you know this could be that um you could be receiving message from your haunt because i spoke about your aunt and that is the taurus virgo or capricorn okay so let's look and see who is this lady who is this aries leo or sagittarius um lady who is this lady um, nine of Wands. Okay, so definitely the energy of the Nine of Wands comes out with this lady. So what this is basically saying is that you are standing your guard and you're protected from this lady. You're standing your guard against this lady for whatever the issue is, and it has to do with money. So you're standing your guard um, from this lady and protecting yourself from this lady. It's as if this lady tried to take you down for everything you have. Whoever this lady is, she's a deceptive person. 
and she tries to take you down for wherever you have now whatever has transpired with this lady I'm beginning to find out this Aries Leo or Sagittarian lady 45 years and old and the nine of ones and the four of Pentacles who is she there was an invitation okay so whoever this lady was you could have been invited out by this lady or um, it could be an invitation because it is a situation where you're in close proximity and close contact with this person whoever this person is or was it's not vibrating on a real positive energy vibration so this could be a family member that you you know she invited you out or something like that and now you have to pick up the bill or something like that okay or um, she wants to go on vacation and you have to pay for it or um, whatever the situation is she's supposed to pay you some money or it is always that you have to be giving her money but it, it, it's coming up of the mother figure or a grandmother or you know this is the issue of money temperance is here for the Aquarians in this week and it has to do with um, you have no more regrets you basically have no more regrets you did what you have to do you have no more regrets you decide um, a hey, I'm not but be, being um, regrets you have no regrets over a new love it's as if you make the decision you have decided hey um, whatever it is I've made the decision I have no more regrets so some of you um, could be um, you know choosing there could be a multiple relationship and you're choosing to be with just one person there's a lot of talking there's a lot of conversation I think there would there was someone new in your life that came in and there is a lot of talking and conversation this person really trying to communicate with you to see where you are and you know whatever they want to um, uh, offer something but they're afraid to offer it and they want more information and you're like hey it doesn't really matter let it go okay um strength um the energy of strength is is in, is, is in the reverse some of you are dealing with a taurus virgo or a capricorn person and it's as if you let go there is no strength you're not you know whatever the situation is so strength with the taurus virgo or capricorn the page of pentacles strength Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Yes, there is a block um, that is on this person. Now, you could be the one who is doing this block, but be careful because you are not aware of who this um, person is. If you're someone who works black magic or so, release that block because you have no idea who this person is okay sad but I'm, I'm I'm letting you know whoever you are release that block from that person because this person is going it's not the right person to put a block on okay so release this person let's look at the Imperial for the Aquarians okay so we have the Emperor in reverse for the Aquarians and we have the king of swords in reverse so you men 45 years and older you could have been um, working against this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person and try to put a block and it's not the right thing that you do because basically um, what is going to be transpiring basically what is going to transpire is that this block is going to be reverse on you so you know you need to understand that there are certain people that you can't do certain stuff with I'm seeing the king of swords 45 years and older definitely in this week there is an issue that is going to be transpiring and it has to do with your business if you're in business there are some issue that is going to be coming up and that is going to transpire um there are going to be doing unreal uh, um, it's, it's as if people whatever you Aquarians have done men 45 years and older there is information that is going to be coming out about your business you men 45 years and older so expect this so you men 45 years and older whatever you have done and however you have affect someone because whatever blocks you have put on this lady is what is coming back to you okay because um, um, there is one thing that you air sign people should understand about earth sign people is that 
you go with the wind. You are the energy of the wind. Okay. You can't work against a stable sign. Okay. The chariot. Definitely. Um, um, the nine of pentacles is in the reverse for you guys. Um, where there is a situation that was transpiring and the nine of swords is in the reverse. So nine, nine, nine. Um, so you guys have 99. It's the end of a cycle. You Aquarians are ending a cycle. Whatever the cycle is, you're ending the cycle and move forward. Okay. So definitely you, uh, you, um, you guys are ending a cycle and move forward. Okay. So, um, let's look at this and let's understand this. So you're moving forward. Wheel of Fortune is in reverse for you Aquarians and you have the Queen of Pentacles. Okay. So whatever the issue is, is that some of you were dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. This is a lady 45 years and older, whatever the issue is that was happening and transpiring, you need to understand. Oh, you need to understand that. You have, um, um, the issue is that you have stepped on the wrong toe, okay? You have definitely stepped on the wrong toe. The world energy is here for the Aquarians where the moon is coming up, the secrets are coming out about you Aquarians. So you Aquarians, page of swords on the silk research is done about you Aquarians okay whatever you have done is now coming out so you Aquarians have definitely done some injustice against this lady you have tried to block a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person it could be that the Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person is blocked if you're using negative forces by this person you need to move the shit down because trust me you can't do that to a hurt sign okay um, you blow with the wind you need to release this and I'm telling you guys okay so the nine nine of Pentacles in reverse uh, nine of uh, um, nine of swords in reverse and the chariot what is this this is a woman so it's gonna affect the women out there there's something that's um, you women it could be women 45 years and older something that you have done um, to another lady it can be women or men and uh, you have done some injustice and now um, you are being blocked they found out what you have done so we have the energy of a new start the wheel of fortune in reverse and the Queen of Pentacles she's standing up right so there's definitely a new offer that is going to be coming in for the Queen of Pentacles because of the Queen of Pentacles um, some information came out and um, they're offering the Queen of Pentacles. So some of you could be working in an organization and have done some injustice to a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn lady, 45 years and older. You are being caught and now this woman is going to be receiving a new contract because whatever that was happening, this, this whole thing came down. The moon and the world, and whenever the moon and the world comes up, you have to understand the moon and the world. The world is the heart and the moon. These are two um, planetary bodies um, that is coming together. And listen to me. The moon is in reverse. The world is standing up. So whatever secrets that you people were holding, it's coming out. Page of Swords. You're under investigation, um, and you're going to be investigated, and it's coming out. The secrets are coming out. The secrets are coming out. So um, be aware of that. So the moon, the heart, and the page of swords. What is this? Yes, there. The truth. The 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 the, the um the lies. The lies, the lies is coming out. The lies are coming out. So you Aquarians has been not being very honest and the lies are coming out. Some of you are walking away from your relationship. If you are in a relationship with a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn, you're walking away from your relationship. But... There's a block that is set up on this relationship. You can't walk away until you resolve certain issues. Okay. 
So, whoever you are, mm, if you're married to a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn, you know, she is being blocked, but the blockage comes because of you. And now you have to resolve whatever you have done. Because I'm seeing all of you men, I'm seeing that your marriage is on the rocks. Um, men, the marriage are on the rocks. Um, there's a lot of issues between daughters, um, kids, and mothers. Um, there is so many issues, especially that is coming up for you. Um, Aquarians in the suite, that is impossible. Um, people, especially the men 45 years and older with business, you're being blocked. You have been blocked. Your family is blocked. Whatever is happening, there is an, un, uh, an investigation that is taking place about you in this week. Okay? It can be investigation. Um, some of you are dealing with kids and issues. Definitely. Um, some of you are dealing with kids and issues. There's a lot of secrets that was kept that is now coming out. So we can see that a lot of issues that was kept is now coming out. So um, whatever that has been happening or whatever that has been transpiring, there is a lot of secrets, a lot of information is going to be coming out in this week um, that um, was kept a secret. And I'm seeing this with the lovers. The lovers are blocked. It's as if they can't travel, they can't go anywhere because there is something that the partner if you are an Aquarius you have created an issue um, and, 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 and and that's what transpiring because you have created an issue you've definitely created an issue and this is a definitely secrets are going to be coming out so um, people who have had secrets they're going to be coming out whatever you have done to someone else is now going to be coming um, I, uh, open we have card one and we have card two. If you choose card one, you have the energy of uh, confused, okay? Confusion is all around you. Don't be distracted. You're doing the right thing. So confusion is around you. Don't be distracted. You are doing the right thing, okay? So there is a lot of confusion around you. Do not be distracted because you're doing the right thing. The second card is intuition okay um you into into intuitive know the right thing to do listen to your inner voice your intuitive to know to do the right things listen to your inner voice so um there is confusion for some of you which is showing in this reading so go back some of you need to go back and find out and listen to the sagittarians reading or i get sagittarians so whoever these fire signs are aries leo or sagittarians if they are your mother or they are your friends or they're connected to you in your life you're going to be having some issues with them the virgos um, you're going to be having some issues with them um, if it's not a Virgo it could be a Taurus or a Capricorn definitely you're going to be having some issues now I'm saying that this issue that you're having with the Queen of Pentacles is um, a karmatic issue okay so listen to your intuition ladies and gentlemen oh my god I, i'm so so happy that that is not my reading because it's going to be a really confusing week namaste until next time